What's up, YouTube? Today I am going to be reviewing the outer aesthetics and the outer body of the iPod 4th generation. So here it is, guys. Just the back of it. Yes, this is used, guys. Just so you know, it's not mine. Well, it is mine, but it was my cousin Maggie's. Let's see iPod. I don't know if you can see it. 16 gigabyte, and then there's all the wire and stuff, yeah. But that was my cousin Maggie's. And. Oh well, it's dead. But yeah, she had given it to me. Sorry guys, it's dead. But it doesn't matter because we're going over the outer aesthetics of this thing, not the inner. Hey, do you guys see that? Hold on. Look at that. See that battery thing? That is way different from what's on the newer phones. Like the phone I'm videoing on right now. So 5C. It's my video on phone. I have a 6, which is my phone that I use and don't want to waste space on videos but yeah the 5c the battery it's the same six but anyway so guys yeah so here's the iPod you can, as you can see it does not have a fingerprint scanner neither does this 5c six does though where is my six uh guess I'll have to build them but that doesn't matter guys okay so here it is. So the back of it is hard aluminum. Um, it's like slick aluminum. I'm guessing it's aluminum, it might be steel. But this is not like the aluminum in the iPhone 6 and the iPod 5 and iPod um, 6. Yeah, iPod 5 and iPod 6. 4G, 5G and 6G, which the G stands for generation. But, uh, yeah, so, this iPod, yeah, I'm pretty sure actually this is steel. If I'm not mistaken, this is steel. Which is good, because when you drop this thing, it offers more protection. On the front, though, this is the same glass <clears throat> that they use in the, <clears throat> sorry guys. This is the same glass that they use in the iPhone 4 and 4S, if I'm not mistaken. Pretty sure. Um, it's pretty, pretty cool, guys. And it comes in a box, just like the iPhone 5C comes in. Like, I don't know where the 5C. But I got my 5S box over here. Hold on, guys. I'll go get my iPhone 5S box. Okay, guys. So here's the iPhone 5S box. It's pretty cool, it's just the 5S in the front, and then you got the Apple logo and the Apple logo, and then iPhone 5S, iPhone 5S. But the iPod box, or the uh, 5C box, both of them are the same. They're nothing like this. The lower part of this, this is plastic. The upper part is plastic, and the upper part sits on top of it. It's a, not even a box, it's like, a rounded shape and it's clear on top and you can see this thing through which I like these better way better the iPhone 6s box I don't have one of those because I don't have an iPhone 6s but when I get one I'll have one but I like the box my sister has one it has the uh, like splash of color on it which is really cool I think an iPhone SE box is really cool too uh, let's see, there's a phone in here, hold on. No, it's too light, there's nothing in here actually. I don't think, let's see. I think here, let's just let it do its own thing. Yeah, nothing in here, mm, my bad guys. Yeah, this is a 16 gigabyte model. 16 gigabyte model. Oh, it's backwards, that was right. 
16 gigabyte. It's backwards though. Um, iPhone 5s. And uh, <clears throat> if you guys are wondering why you're recording on a 5c when you can record on a 5s, well, the iPhone 5s has the same exact camera as the 5c. It records in 1080p HD. That's the 5c does the same. They were released on the same day. So yeah, the, pretty much the same. Let's have, well, I don't want everyone to criticize me. No, they're not the same, not even close. They are close. Uh, the outer body, that's not even close. But the internal parts, that's it's like a better iPhone 5, just not quite the 5S yet. Not with the fingerprint scanner or anything. Here has nothing in the box. Plain box. But uh, let's put that aside. Let's get this iPod back. Um, so yeah, this is the iPod. And the charger that it takes, I have one right here. It's not the standard Apple charger, but this is the 30 pin charger. Goes in right here. Clips in like that. Yeah. The iPod's dead, like I said, but this charger's not plugged up. But the thing that's cool about this has an auxiliary cord on the end of it. And the hard or the USB cable plug in to the uh, box. But yeah. So yeah, that's pretty cool. And um <clears throat> yeah, so here's the outer body of this iPod 4. Pretty nice iPod actually. My favorite iPods of all is the iPhone or er, iPod. My favorite iPod of all is the iPod 6, which is really nice. Uh, it's, it kind of looks like an iPhone to me. It does. Like the front of this kind of looks like an iPhone 4. If I had that extra little line and the dot was on the side of it. And I had another shorter line up on the top. And I just showed you guys it like this. You think it was an iPhone 4. Since it doesn't have the, uh, what do you call it? The, like, speaker, I guess. The call speaker. Do you guys know? And then you guys know it's an iPod. And the back, totally different. But yeah, guys, so that is the outer aesthetics of the iPod 4. Home button. Volume rockers. So yeah, guys, I would really appreciate it if you would like, subscribe, and comment what you think about this video. Yeah, uh, this is my first video I've made, so I think I did pretty good for the first video. What do you guys think? Yeah, just comment below what you guys think. Um, so yeah, uh, just like, subscribe, and comment, and I'm going to be reviewing more Apple products. I have a lot of Apple products to review, and I'm going to be getting more to review. And uh, I just want to start out simple with a, a iPod 4, because it's my first video. So, like and subscribe, guys. Comment your opinions of this video. And uh, if you guys want me to do like a drop test on this iPod, like shoot it with a BB gun or a pellet gun or something. Comment below and tell me that. But for now guys, peace, like, subscribe, and comment. See you guys later.